sub-zero wind chill values. That's the fifth longest streak that we've had here. We've got positive territory today, and the 24 that we're seeing right now feels a little balmy out there. We've got winter weather advisories in place, not for Indianapolis, but areas north of Indianapolis. So Hamilton County, you're included in this. Zionsville, Whitestown, Kokomo, Muncie, and areas north. And notice the pink here. This is a winter storm warning for uh, Porter County, also LaPorte County, and also western sections of St. Joseph County. We're going to see a very strong lake effect snow band set up, and it is really going to produce some significant snow farther north. That's why we do have that winter storm warning in place. Just a few flurries out there right now across parts of North Manchester, also into Wabash as well. We have this little weak little wave pushing through. I do think we're going to see the potential for a little bit of light flurries and a few snow showers here in central Indiana. Back to the west. This is our next system. This clipper system is going to quickly move through, and later tonight we'll begin to see some of that snow pushing through. So let's take a look here at Futurecast. What we have going on here, maybe a light dusting of snow pushing through. They're about lunchtime today here in central Indiana. And then as we go overnight tonight, a Thursday, here is 8 o'clock. We'll see the chance for some snow in northern sections of Indiana that will overspread the entire state here overnight and midnight tonight. And then during the first part of daybreak tomorrow, I think by mid morning, this is a picture on nine o'clock, much of the accumulating snow moves off to the east, but zero in here, northwestern sections of Indiana, Porter, LaPorte counties, uh, seeing a lake effect snow band really setting up here and it's going to produce some significant amounts. Let's talk about amounts here in central Indiana. Again, with this first little wave bushing through early on today, I think we'll see maybe a light coating, a dusting, but one to two inches possible through the overnight hours early tomorrow morning and then farther northward where we are under that winter weather advisory. About two to four, possibly around three inches or so from Kokomo, Muncie. Farther north you go, the more snow you will see. And this bullseye here in northwestern sections of Indiana, that's where we could pick up a, a foot of snow across parts maybe of Valparaiso, Porter County, also western sections of LaPorte County as well. We've got mostly cloudy skies, a live look here from our Speedway camera. A balmy 24 degrees right now in Indianapolis. Feels like temperatures coming in into the teens statewide. During the day today, we'll go with mostly cloudy skies. A few flurries here stretching through about the lunch hour. Temps today up to 29 degrees. Indianapolis 27, South Bend, Kokomo, and into the 30s in southern sections of Indiana. Tonight will fall into the teens. We've got a bitter blast of cold air pushing in here after that system moves out. I don't think this is going to be here for too long. I think it's going to be brief, but it is going to be cold for the day tomorrow. Temperatures in the upper teens. Uh, we'll see the chance for some on and off snow flurries possible. Best chance of that accumulating snow will be for the first part of the day. So frigid air continues here as we go into the weekend, but then mild temperatures return. We have not been above freezing since last Friday. And it looks like we'll finally be above freezing next week. In your Hensley Legal Group 8-day forecast, 17 on Saturday, 24 on Sunday under mostly sunny skies with single-digit nighttime lows, 34 on Monday and into the 40s, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday.